Welcome to its tomorrow news. I am Hena Talati. Flood scale 29 in northern China as new storm bears down. Severe floods in China's northern province of Hebei brought the remnants of the typhoon, killed at least 29 people and caused billions of the dollars in economic losses. State media reported on Friday that the rescue crews are still searching for 16 people missing in the storm that has brought on the most severe rainfall since records began 140 years ago. Official news agency reported the province's reconstruction is expected to take two years to complete. Initial estimates showed its direct economic losses amounting to $13.2 billion, state media China News Service said. Preliminary estimates announced showed 33.9 million residents or about 5% of the province's pollution were affected by the floods and more than 40,000 houses collapsed, it said. A further 155,000 houses and facilities that provided electricity and communications were seriously damaged. Hundreds of the thousands of the hectares of the crops were ruined in the province. More than 1.75 million residents have been relocated. Repairs to damaged power cables and other facilities were underway. According to the agency, the government pledged to ensure affected residents can move back to their homes and to have new ones before winter. China's state media hailed the government's efforts to mitigate damage from the inundations, with coverage focused on tales of mutual aid and selfless officials working tirelessly on rescue efforts. But a week after the waters still swelled, some villagers in the Hebei said they did not receive adequate warnings from the authorities about when the floods could come. Streets in the parts of Hebei, which borders the capital Beijing, were still caked in mud on Friday while the residents scrambled to recover waterlogged belongings and clean up damaged homes. The deluge followed weeks of the historic hit, with the scientists saying such extreme weather events were being exacerbated by the climate change. Heavy rains are expected again over the weekend as the tropical depressions canon, formerly a typhoon, approaches China. Emergency alert levels are being held in place across the northern China, agency said, with the key riverways being closely monitored. But the bad weather is not limited to northern China only. On Friday, the state flood control and drought relief headquarters said heavy rain was also likely over the weekend in the south southwestern provinces of Sichuan and Yunnan and the northwestern province of Gansu and Qinghai. At least seven people died in a flash flood southwest of the Sichuan's capital Chengdu this week after an unexpected tide of water washed away a number of tourists on the Longski River. And in the Gansu, five people were killed when they were swept away by the mountain torrents after a rainstorm in Thursday. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news. For more global weather updates like this, subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates. <laughs>